Hello. How's everyone doing today? Um, we are back here on Arkham Origins. It's been a few days. I apologize. Okay, Alfred, shut the fuck up. He was fucking yelling at me before I even fucking got here. I started recording, I mean. But we are back with some Arkham Origins. Um, yeah, let's get this shit started. Apparently, he said he prepped a bat wing. We're about to go to fight the penguin, or at least see the penguin at Jezebel Palace. Um, bro, shut the f Jesus fuck. You are worse than fucking Atreus and Freya and fucking God of War, man. Like, chill out. Okay, I'm leaving. Fuck. I was just gonna look around. <laughs> to make your travels easier, I went ahead and set up some auto nav points at different the Bowery the city. on the Gotham City. My preset destinations should take you right to Jezebel Plaza. Okay, on the Gotham City map, select a Batwing drop point to fast travel to that location in the city. Okay, it's kind of crazy that this was like actually the first Batman game that really like. I don't know if other games did this around the time, but this is the first one that did Gotham City like open world. I think. And it is kind of dead. I forget what the reasoning is. I guess maybe we'll find out. But yeah, this one's basically taking us right to where he was saying. You do realize it's Christmas Eve, sir. That was, this thing's fucking fast. I kid you not, you guys, when I started recording this fucking video, I started getting sniffles, like, last time. Like, what the fuck's going on? Maybe it has something to do with the winter. So, around this area, I believe, is when the last time, like, it crashed. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it just had, like, really, a really weird lag spike, so... I'm hoping it's not going to crash, but I guess we'll see. And I'm going to be rusty as fuck again. Also, in the last fucking episode, I got my fucking ass kicked by Killer Croc. <laughs> and I realized after, I was like, I, the whole time, like, I had no clue. But I was like, bro, are we on fucking hard difficulty? And we were. That was the first thing I did. Like, the first three minutes of this video, I was talking. As soon as I go in to start the fucking story mode i sit there and i go straight to hard and just didn't think about it i guess and that's why it was so fucking difficult oh dude that's so cool what the hell is it i'll pull this trigger i ain't playing i should use my smoke pellets here i need to get up and out of danger you can't shoot what you can't see oh i like that you can't shoot what you can't see good way to get myself shot Probably the hostage too. All right, so what do you say? An attack from above. Nobody ever does. Oh shit! And last time the game was really quiet. So, hold on. I want to put everything at half now, because last time I had to like do some editing afterward. Okay, that's good. Come here, bitch. Get fucked. Screw this, I quit. Screw this, I quit. Where are the rest of the bastards? Did they leave? Okay. So this is a silent mission. How do I... Okay, there you go. I don't remember any of the fucking buttons right now. I'm hoping you guys can't hear... Um, my controller as much as you did before. I was playing with it up top. I'm wondering if I go under, it'll work. Ooh, that was fucking sick. And call the police. They'll want to see what's going on here. Okay, I will. This was just supposed to be a service call. Okay, okay, I hear ya. I hear ya. Well, you're dead now. Nighty night. I can I can fix the tower. Whatever you want. Just please don't hurt me. 
All I want is for you to get yourself to safety. <laughs> it's so weird seeing Batman like this. Like, in all the shit I've seen recently, Batman is, like, known as a... You know, like, he's known in Gotham as a good guy. But since this is, like, the beginning of the Arkham trilogy, like, before Asylum, it makes sense. Like, they don't know who he is, and he's kind of terrifying. Just a psychotic dude dressed as a fucking bat. Running around, kicking ass. I don't think this tower malfunction is from storm damage. I need to set up a crime scene and find out what happened. And I should start by identifying the victim. Okay, so you guys, if you guys are seeing this, this is where it crashed last time. So hopefully, whatever was making it crash doesn't do it again. I still don't really know. Maybe it was like I back then I had to upgrade drivers or something, but I guess we'll see. Victim's name is David. But I also might have been on my old PC. Sent so. to repair a faulty network tower. But what killed him? Scanning the DNA impact on the wall should provide an answer. Dude, it's crazy. This is the best detective mode in like most like in all the Batman games, I think. This and Night are really close together. But Night is also like probably the best Batman game of all time. Impact analysis indicates the victim was killed by some kind of explosion. Originating Holy fuck. Panel. I should scan it for additional clues. Access panel. Scanned. It looks like the panel was rigged to detonate when swiped with a key card. Someone really didn't want this tower repaired. And it looks like that same someone left a set of fingerprints behind. Idiot. Alfred, I'm uploading some prints for analysis. Let me know what comes back. Certainly, sir. Searching now. And here we are. They belong to one John F. Baker. He's a John F. Baker. Criminal. Small jobs, mostly. And they... hmm. That's curious. What's curious? Mr. Baker's dead, sir. His body was recovered from the Diamond District just under an hour ago. Looks like someone's tying up loose ends. Oh, shit. I can bypass the booby-trapped access panel with my cryptographic sequencer, but I'll need the encryption. <laughs> that is such the victim's access card. <laughs> Reviewing the crime scene will show. That is such a is. Batman name for something. The cryptographic sequencer. Okay, well I guess we have to pay attention to where his shit went. Okay, I remember. I see it. I see his key card. Can I stop? Imagine somebody not doing that, they just like look at this vent and they see it's in there. <laughs> or maybe it like doesn't spawn until you fucking... I don't need it, I, it's right here! Okay, I'll scan it for you. Batman's gotta be very thorough, I understand. This card has the codes I need to hack any of the network tower's access panels. Oh, okay, so I didn't even need the card, I just needed its presence. Unfortunate. Okay. Kind of toxic, but okay. Okay, 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 okay. So, again, around this area is where it crashed. So, we're it's going good so far. I don't really know the exact place it would crash, but I think we're past Alfred, it. Contact the GCP. Yeah, I don't remember this. Know about the body. Send the data Although, it was too. just... Certainly, sir. Does this mean you found the source of the disturbance? I think so. Open that shit, bat! Nice. <laughs> the way he opened that shit. Yeah, I don't remember this at all, so... Like I said, before the time that I opened it that one time, I hadn't played that shit since it came out, probably. My cryptographic sequencer can't find shit. Wait, hold on. Okay, I have no clue what I'm supposed to be looking for here. Can I just... Do I have to... Do I have to do that? Oh, I can open this door. Thank God. No, I can't. <laughs> I... You guys, I have no clue what the fuck they want me to see. Well, well, if it isn't the oh, okay. It probably wasn't supposed to be this. I know who that is. Enigma, then. Oh, you 
must think you're so clever. Well, how's this for clever? I've taken control of towers all over the city. As long as they're active, your bat wing's useless. And it looks like it's gonna stay that way. I'm hey, fuck you. I'm begging to be taken offline, and you still can't hack it. Pun intended, of course. Yeah, very clever. Mm, black mask's not going to like this. <laughs> what are you talking about? Wouldn't you like to know? I would. So apparently, I was just doing nothing there. With the jammer offline. You travel here with the bat <laughs> Of course, I was. Oh my god. Those relays are part of a distributed security system. I wonder what they're protecting. That must be. Are you just gonna go on and on about this? Oh shit! Visit. You guys saw my mouse. My <laughs> my shit up there. I apologize. It's gone now. I see you've regained control of the Batwing, sir. Yep. I suppose it's off to Jezebel Plaza, then. That's the plan. Then I've also got a lead on Enigma. Well, don't overthink it too much, sir. We both know you'll eventually wind up doing both. Uh, I'm not a side... Here's a fun fact about me. I am not a side quest kind of guy. I don't know if I've said that in previous series, but I'm just not, dude. Like, I... I'm a very focused, like, story-focused person, so when there's side shit, I feel like it interrupts the story. And most of the time, side stuff in video games doesn't add to it, like, at all. <laughs> like, sometimes it, like, builds the world, and then sometimes it just, just feels kind of annoying and unnecessary. But guys, the good news is, we didn't crash! So this series can fucking go on after fucking three years of promising. Fly. It's crazy. Like this, for some people, is their favorite Arkham game, and it wasn't even made by Rocksteady. Oh, I want to fight, bro. I may be on hard mode, but your boy can still fucking kick ass with all these thugs. Oh, what? I fucking was spamming that shit. Surround him. Oh, bro, I was fucking... Okay, okay, sums off, sums off. <laughs> that was around the time when we were fighting Killer Croc and shit. I was like, something ain't right. These fucking thugs are doing way too much damage. Get this fucker with a pipe. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, fuck. This motherfucker just snapped his fucking ankle, bro. I remember fucking Batman was brutal in this game, but god damn. Bro, just breaking his fucking bones and shit. You won't fucking kill anybody, but you're gonna disfigure him for fucking life. <laughs> Bitch. That was a fun one. I like that crime of progress. I think it's funny that like so it's Christmas theme and shit. Use my grapnel accelerator. You're a who and a hot and a what now? Wait, I don't use the grapple. I've been using that, right? Oh yeah, the hold it. I didn't know that. My grapnel accelerator. Yeah, that. That shit is nice, and since they like introduced that, I think it like came into Batman Arkham Knight later, which is so fucking sick. I hope you'll try to keep a low profile tonight, sir. Trust me, I'll take out those assassins before they even know I'm there. It's just that. If some curious child looks out to see who's pattering across their rooftop, they expect Santa Claus. <laughs> Not a black clad bat creature. Black creature. <laughs> I don't patter, Alfred. 
But yeah, like in this one, like uh, this world. Oh shit, we're already here. Is there a way to enter from here? I don't think so. Get down. What is this? What the fuck just happened to me? What the fuck? Can we, uh... Battering, maybe? No. Okay, it doesn't look like we can do anything with this. I don't know how we're supposed to get over there. Uh... Like, I think they did a good job on Gotham, but there isn't really a reason why Gotham is so empty besides it was the technological, technological, <laughs> okay, <laughs> the technological, ad like, advancements had not been met yet to, like, provide the amount of people that they would need to have in a city, so I don't, ooh, I want to fight these guys, come here, bitch. I gotta get used to this combat somehow. I've been playing too much God of War and shit and Darksiders and all this other shit, so. Come here, bitch. Poor bitch. Oh god, fuck. <laughs> By the way, pardon my French. I got a nasty mouth. Ooh! Oh my god. No. I, I hope the fucking, um, the button mesh is not so loud in this video. I was tempted to fucking edit it last video, but it was, it was like, I would be saying shit and it would still be there, you know what I mean? So it wasn't much I could do, <laughs> except just leave it in there. And I'm hoping that having it under the desk is better for audio, but I think I've done that before and you can still hear it, just not as loud. And hopefully the game is loud enough that it like covers up the sound. Hold on, I don't know where I'm supposed to go still. We're supposed to be over here. Jezebel Palace. This isn't a door though, so it's like, Maybe it's this way? Around? Yeah, it's definitely gotta be around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The entrance is this way, it says. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. You just follow that giant bat signal. That's, a, that's such a good idea. God, Rocksteady, y'all are geniuses, man. I know this was made by WB Montreal, but they're the ones who came up with the bat signal pointing to where you're supposed to be. Like, that's just so fucking useful. <gasps> I remember this place. Looks like I'm the first one here. I need to find a spot where I can stake this place out unnoticed. Oh, yeah. I remember this scene. Pop the knuckles real hey, quick. Gwen. Not a dime changes hands in this city he can't tell you about. If anyone knows where Black Mask and his assassins are, it's him. Dude, this but narration. find. His men are doing a deal. Oh, here. dude, he looks so menacing. Talk. <laughs> so, little boys, what do you want for Christmas? Oh, my Wait, God. I already know. Hey, it's Sub Zero. At least his voice. I, I think it might be Steve Bloom. I don't know if it's him, actually. His name's Loose Lips. <laughs> What kind of weaponry is that? Oh, dude, that is such a sick shot. Here we go. Some fly by night operation. I'll show you a fly by night operation, you motherfuckers. Fucking selling illegal weapons, narcotics. 
I'm the fucking back cop, bitch. Oh, God. Sloppy, bro. I'm so sloppy. I will get better, I promise. Oh, my God. You fuckers, don't mess this up for me. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, fuck. Got a good combo going. Fuck you, bitch. This guy's wearing the dipper hat. <laughs> this other guy, too. We got some action. Nope. This would actually be so fucking terrifying. Fucking Batman just annihilating your whole ass crew. And all you could do is sit there and watch. Come here, pussy. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is what really made the game, like, amazing to me. Where's the penguin? Where is he? Oh, shit. He passed out. <laughs> Wake up. What happened? <laughs> Holy shit. The clock the ticking. Clock. Holy fuck. There's cobble pot. Let me go. If you insist. Oh shit. <laughs> That is so sick. Please stop. Stop. I'll go. I'll tell you anything you want to know. Please. Too late. I already have what I need. No. Ah! Oh my god. You're crazy. You're freaking crazy. <laughs> if I can read this SIM card, I may be able to locate Penguin. Alfred, I'm getting interference on my comm systems. Is that on your side? No, sir. I'm seeing it as well. It's from the nearby GCR tower. It's the same signal jamming the Batwing's auto now. Because, of course. I've highlighted the tower on your map. I'll need to stop that signal before I can track down the penguin. So this is the guy that... Available Fuck! Shut up! I'm trying to talk! This is the guy that, um... This Roger Craig Smith... Didn't look up if that was his name, by the way. Um... <laughs> this is a guy that everybody want, who's petitioning right now, they want him to replace Kevin Conroy. And, like, I would not be mad at it. He voices him a lot in, like, all these animated shits. Like, in some of the most recent ones I can think of, the Long Halloween. If y'all haven't seen that animated fucking movie, y'all need to see it. Troy Baker, the dude who voices the Joker in this one, also voices the Joker in that one. What an incredible fucking movie, man. Like, so good. I gotta read the comic book because apparently there's some things that they changed, but it's whatever. Just some nerdy shit. Oh my god. Okay. 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 I am getting fucked up right now. I gotta focus. Focus time. Get fucked. Pussy. You should have stayed on the ground. Give me that bat. It's not yours. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay. Well, it's like Dark Souls now. I'm one shot. You only get one shot. One opportunity. Better stop before I get copywritten. As a fucking YouTuber with 19 subscribers. <laughs> get fucked, bitch. Get fucked. Have you really decided to try and take me on? Can't do it then. I'm looking forward to watching you fail. Okay. Toxic, but okay. Um, I like close combat the most in this shit, so... Let's get ballistic armor, though. Let's even it out. Eventually, we're gonna have to run into fuckers with bullets and shit, so... I know exactly what we gotta do already. Take the remote control battering. Oh god, I forgot... 
problem when you can just throw crap at it. This is how I like to use it, just fucking boost. Nice. Now let me open the door. Nice. Batman's fucking strong, bro. You know, if you had asked nicely, I'd have opened it for you. Cap. Keep out. Congratulations are in order. Maybe you're not as stupid as I've been led to believe. Why are you The fuck does that even mean, right? man? Direct. I like it. So, I'll tell you. Gotham sullied. It's filled with brutes who control this city through violence and intimidation. You didn't answer my question. Because you didn't let me finish. <laughs> <clears throat> I want to get rid of them, Batman, to improve Gotham's intellectual and moral standing. But I'm not a thug like you. My approach is a bit more refined. What you're doing is no different than stealing. There's nothing refined about it. <laughs> Your response is as predictable as it is banal. Goodbye. Goodbye. I will say, there's a lot of villains in Batman's rogues no, gallery. That's the SIM card I took from that arms dealer and hacked Penguin's communications. Nice. There's a lot of, like, um, people in Batman's rogues gallery. I feel like the Riddler might be, like, my least favorite. Like, well, Batman has some pretty stupid villains, but, like, the Riddler, as, as big ones, he's kind of boring, low-key. This is dedication to Christmas, bro. God damn. They got this type of shit in New York? Like, ain't nobody gonna be even seeing these. Find and have those walkie talkies. I can triangulate their wits position. Maybe like helicopters and planes and shit. Helicopter, helicopter. Intensive training. I got a new challenge, man. I'm not on anybody, bro. I'm not fighting you guys. There's so many Dark Knight challenges popping up, bro. Fuck. Glide. I'm not flying. I'm falling with style. <laughs> I mean, I know you're like Batman, you know, but like, isn't it cold? Like, I know you're all wrapped up, but like, well, he's got a like, he's got like skin tight suit under. I think. I think that's what they showed us in the beginning. He's here. I'm ready to fight, bitches. What the fuck? I didn't even know I was on top of a fucking desk or something. Okay, well, okay, okay, let's keep this pattern going. Zigzag, zigzag it, zigzagging it, zigzagging it. Get fucked, get fucked. No, 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 no. Fuck! You fucking stupid whore! <laughs> I had a great thing going and you just had to come and fucking ruin it! I just cleaned this mess! Can I keep it clean? For five minutes? Or is it ten minutes? I don't remember. This whole, this whole video has just been me, like, referencing movies and shit. Do we go under? No. Unconscious. 41 BPM. God damn. Wait, what is this thing? I won't be able to find Penguin unless I get the SIM card from their walkie-talkie. Who's? Wait, who's he talking about? Oh, this one right here. Penguin, unless I get the SIM card from their walkie talkie. <laughs> Man, it really sucks that Kevin Conroy's gone, because, like, this guy's good, but Kevin's voice is just unmatched, bro. Like, it's really sad that the last time I'll ever see him is going to be in Suicide Squad Killed the Justice League, because from the leaks that I've seen and, like, all this other shit, I feel like. 
I feel like it's just gonna be bad, bro. Like, God. And it has so much potential, and I really don't want it to be bad. But, like, you know how this world is right now. And especially since the two creators of Rocksteady in the beginning pulled out of, um... Not the two creators, but, like, the two CEOs. They pulled out mid-production, or, like, in the beginning of production of Suicide Squad Killed the Justice League. So, it's, like, it's not looking good for that game, bro. And if it is Kevin's last hurrah, I just wanted to be good. I need to find the next comm station. Then I'll be able to triangulate Penguin's position. All right. <laughs> I swear it was the bat. He dropped Ricky off the roof of the clock tower straight into the Christmas tree. I don't care what you think you saw. If you're not back here with my money in the next ten minutes, I'll cut your damn eyeballs out. Ow. And then you won't have to worry about seeing nothing ever again. Is that clear? Yes, Mr. Cobblepot. Is that Mr. clear? That is such a good Cobblepot voice. I think that's the same one. I appreciate that they got some of the same voice actors. I understand why they went with the other two, like, because it had to be a younger Batman and all this shit. But still, like, you what? He's. It's like four years before Arkham Asylum. Like, I don't know about you guys, but my voice didn't change that much in four. Eh, that's a lie. Like, I watched some of my videos from, like, Arkham. Arkham Asylum. And I'm like, damn, bro. I, I do not sound like that anymore. Like, I'm pretty close. But my pitch is like completely different in that video. You motherfucker, bro. Sometimes they have like a delayed punch and then they fucking just punch me right in the fucking ass. Bitch. Oh my fucking god. Okay. You're not gonna like the feel of this. Fucking picks up a fucking pipe. Bro, I... <laughs> I'm tired, okay? That's what it is. I'm tired. God damn. Okay, I was gonna say, none of them have fucking been out yet. I think that's... Okay, that's three now that have been knocked out. Nice. <laughs> you hear those people next door? They're like, I'm beating the shit out of these fuckers. I'm not going to help with that, bro. I am busy. <laughs> Batman can't be everywhere at once. As much as he would like to be. Oh, fuck. Okay, so there's... This is a... This is a gun one. Silent takedown? Silent tower. Another silent takedown. Mm -hmm. This is how I always like to play this game, like, in this mode. So fucking useful, man. These games really make you feel like Batman. It's insane. Hey, I got an achievement! Well, that's not really much of an achievement. Like, that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> okay, what do I do now? Okay, I gotta get out of this mode now. Oh, I was supposed to be down here. Damn, I'm high up. He's gonna do a superhero landing. He's gonna do a superhero landing. <laughs> Dude, I'm so excited for the next Deadpool. If you guys didn't know, that's what that's from, Deadpool. I think it's Deadpool 1. Alright, well. What are we gonna do now, All Batman? Right, everyone. Listen up. I know I ought to cancel our annual <laughs> Tech. 
fights after what happened tonight at Jezebel. Park. Oh, it's Wayne Tech. But just there to you show are. you what a nice I'm guy I am, the fights are still on. That's what that ship so is called. That's kind of right cool. Now if you want in on this. The and final the offer. On an old ship. No wonder it's been so hard to find. Wait for laggers. Penguin just goes on and on, doesn't he, bro? Like, motherfucker won't shut up. He's either threatening to rip off your fucking hair, kill your mum, as he says. Snipers out. I'll have to take the snipers down silently to proceed. Oh shit, I didn't realize this guy was here. Well, it's a good thing I'm taking him out. Okay, there's another guy over there. Oh shit, they all got guns. I actually remember this area. Surprisingly. Because I, like, don't remember any other area. Get fucked. Bro, these guys is, like, I've always said it. Their peripherals are absolute dog shit, man. Like, how do you not see a flying bat, like, right next to you? In eye level. Like, I would have seen that shit. Another one bites the dust. Wait, what the fuck? What was that? Another one down. Oh, God. This guy's patrolling. I can get out of the advance if he's gonna come all the way this way. I don't think he will, though. Oh man, this guy's right. Let's give him a hand. Let's give him a hand. Oh shit, there's a bunch of them. You didn't deserve this, man. They're all using those splatter guns. Have you guys seen those shits? The one you put the Orbeez in? <laughs> That's exactly what they look like, that model. Hold on, can I upgrade while I'm in an encounter? Dude, I can. Um, increase battering, stun time, glide boot. What does this have to do with Predator shit? All this shit comes later, but I'm excited for it. Core controls. Oh, they just have a whole section for the controls. Well, since we're dealing with blaze, let's get this shit. Nice. Y'all just gonna stand here, bro? Okay, spread out. Thank you. Another one dead. Or just mm, knocked out, <laughs> unconscious. Again, peripheral is so bad, Jesus. They see me? They are so fucking blind, bro. And I'm on hard mode, too. That's what makes this even better. Like, this is the best AI could be in fucking 2013. <laughs> I wonder if it's going to be any better, because I'm pretty sure eventually we're going to be playing all these games. Like, and obviously, City is everybody's favorite. I think I'm more of a night guy myself. This was definitely one of my favorites back in the day, but I don't know. There's something about... Kevin Conroy, like the the environment that they build in Night and City is just so much better in my opinion. But I take this guy out. Mm. 
another one dead. I mean, why do I keep saying dead? Well, he's dead, you know, he's he's dead for the moment. If you really think about it, falling asleep is basically just like dying. It's basically like dying, but without your heart stopping. Because your brain kind of shuts off pretty much everything except like your vital shit. <laughs> but I guess. But did they get it is? <laughs> Good night. Have fun, friend. Don't let the bad bugs bite. <laughs> well, that was easy. 7k XP. Holy shit. Nice. A loading screen, bro. I haven't seen one of those in so long. Looks like someone brought a bat to a night fight. Oh yeah, you don't want to fuck with me? I know how to fight nice. <laughs> I knew that shit was gonna fucking happen. Fuck you, bitch. Ow. Dude, I love this penguin. He's great. I'll sort out you lot. Who's ready for some action? Penguin is hosting some kind of fighting tournament. That's where I need to go. Oh, uh, dude, I want to join the fighting tournament. Is that what we're going to do? There's people firing guns. Oh, they're... He's like advertising and shit. <laughs> Bro, I don't remember this at all. Holy fuck. That's gonna be this whole series, bro. I'm not gonna remember anything. That's the man. Bitch, no guns. Ow. I always think he's gonna fucking do it in time, and so I just do it. But I guess every time that blue shit pops up, I need to just start fucking countering. Hey, I ain't no nut job, okay? I'm just a normal person who has some hobbies. Like you guys, being criminals, that's your hobby. Don't judge me because I'm not like you guys, you know? Oh, I don't have the, the double fucking counter yet. Bitch. Bitch. Nice. All right now, what the fuck are we gonna do? Well, we gotta go through this door. I really want to be a part of that fucking. I wonder if that's what's gonna happen. I'm like reliving this with you guys. This is sick. Candy. I like I like women named Candy. I think that's hot. Ah, uh, that's hot. Run. Nothing in here. I'm so used to like finding secrets because of God of War. Oh, that's death. <laughs> that's so funny. Like, they all think he's not real. Like, who did they think was attacking them? Oh, wait, do we have that thing? Uh, we do not. I don't have the shit to get across here yet, I don't think. Okay, so where do I go then? This here was death too, right? I think. Yeah, where do I go? Hmm. Maybe I wasn't supposed to go this way? Oh my god, that was a big yawn. <laughs> Holy shit. I don't think we can go this way. Okay, well, I guess I'll go around. Maybe we can, like, go back and see where it's supposed to be. Oh, 
well, this has got to be where it's supposed to be because they brought us over here to the crew quarters and then. Okay. I apologize, guys. You guys know I'm slow. You guys saw that Last of Us series and how many times I got stuck in a puzzle or something. So, <laughs> you guys know this is going to take me a minute. How did I miss? Grime. Grime. There's got to be some over here. Can I jump onto that ledge? Yep. Nice. All right. Where we go from here? Hell yeah, there's more people to fight over here. Bitch! Bro, power to that guy for not getting knocked out from that. I would be out like a fucking light. Some hands in the engine room. Drop that fucking bottle, pussy. Fuck you. Nope. Nope. Can you motherfuckers just die already? Fuck me. Batter up! I'm saying all this shit like hella slow. <laughs> nice. This used to be a nice neighborhood. Okay, now we can grab this shit with this, right? Yep. I remember. I remember that. Now we can pull this shit and pull ourselves around. See? There's some shit I remember. <laughs> Candy sounds like she's sick of her job. I can get up. Oh, I can pull this thing down. Nice. Hell yeah. All right, lads. The rest of you losers to be are going to have to embarrass yourselves without me. God knows you can do it. It's a business to take care of in the office. I don't want to be disturbed. Aw, oh, man, you can't open the door. Fuck, I want to be a part of it. Penguin, I want to see this. I want to see sis. What the fuck does that even mean? Oswald C. Cobblepot. Black Market Racketeer. Based in Gotham City. Eye color blue. I cannot tell. Hair color black. He is four foot ten. <laughs> Dude, he is so small. Holy shit. 175 pounds. Like, I knew he was small, but 410? God. Up and coming crime boss. Extensive underworld connections. Cunning and paranoia make him a difficult foe to nail down. The Penguin operates a black market on his modified luxury liner. The final offer. Cobblepot is tapped into Gotham's underworld like no other. If there's a deal going on somewhere in the city, Cobblepot knows about it. And is probably involved in some way. He is a careful he's careful about maintaining a low profile when it comes to his gang's dealings, which makes it difficult to pin this criminal activity directly on him. While he doesn't offer much in the way of physical threat, he does carry concealed weapons and keeps a large number of his thugs around to protect him. Yeah, I always saw, like, the Penguin, and he always seems like kind of a jobber, like, like somebody that Batman just got to get through every once in a while, because, like, he's not that big of a threat, bro. Like, he just has a lot of thugs, you know what I mean? Like, he has a lot of connections, so he could get people to threaten you, but he himself, like, you get him. will be in his office. Tracy should know where that is. I'll make her talk. Tracy? Okay. We're gonna beat up a woman now. That's where we. That's where we're going, Batman. I, I didn't. I didn't see you like that. <laughs> Tracy should know where she is. I'll make her talk. I'm Batman. I got a hard bat cock. <laughs> I'm vengeance. <laughs> Fucking vengeance. Okay. Well, what is? This is just a Riddler shit, man. I don't want to be here then. If 
Fuck me, bro. Fuck off. I'm just trying to get through this shit. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Let me go. Oh god. Oh god, I'm stuck. <laughs> well, shit. Uh, you guys didn't see that. You guys, you guys didn't see that. <laughs> that one is on purpose. Go through. Um, no, that has to be where we're supposed to go. Man, there's a lot of fucking shit, man. I mean, I kind of knew it's where we had to go, but I didn't know like what direction I was supposed to be heading in there. Nice, okay. So there must be something else besides that Riddler trophy that I didn't see while I was in here. Oh, you can pull these down. I didn't know if you could. Is there a Riddler trophy in here? No, we could just get through. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Ooh. She's kind of a baddie. Hell yeah. You just saved me a lot of trouble coming here, bad man. I'm gonna kill you. Then I'm gonna jumpstart your heart. And kill you again. <laughs> that is a cool threat. He looks so cool. I'm ready. Hell yeah, bro. I'm looking for Black Mask. Where is he? <laughs> I ain't here to talk. I'm here to kick your ass. This is your last chance. Just think of me as a fat never. Now, come to me. <laughs> to show me where the penguin is. All right, you lousy mugs. Time to earn your supper. To earn your supper. Out of all the people you could have worked for, you worked for the penguin? Ain't no way homie pays well or anything. Oh, shit. I'm gonna see him coming. Bro, it's like it wants to do it, and then it doesn't do it because I don't have it, so... Oh god. Oh god. There are so many, holy fuck. This is getting bad, gents. Holy fuck. Sorry for that Discord, Nody. Did your mother teach you to fight like that? <laughs> I'm not even fat. Oh, God. Well, that guy's out. Like a light. I gotta stop singing, bro. I'm gonna get fucking copywritten. Bro, fuck. That's such bullshit. I just had to go sicko mode, bro. I had to fuck them up. Fuck you. Oh my god, there's so many more. Oh god, okay, 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 okay. This is gonna be most of- No! Bro, I had a feeling I was gonna fucking die right there. God fucking damn, it's all because I hit those fucking pipes, bro. And that's why I'm the boss. Shut the fuck up. Now, if you'll excuse me. Holy shit. I got business to attend to. Piss off. That facial capture was actually really good. Holy shit. Well, that's like four deaths. <laughs> I had a feeling I was gonna die in that one. 
All right, but now that I have full health and my armored health, they don't stand a chance. And I was on a fucking rhythm last match. Oh shit! I gotta, I gotta be a YouTuber. I gotta talk. I, I, I don't know what to fucking talk about when I'm fucking fighting these fuckers. The knives guys are really annoying. I hate like anybody in these games that have like weapons and shit while I'm trying to fuck these guys up, like hand to hand. Like it gets really annoying when they start bringing in like the armor dudes and and the fucking knives all together and guns. Like I hate that shit. Fuck! I almost had a perfect man. Not really. There's like another. Another fucking phase, I think. Why did it work there? I don't understand. Maybe I do have the double counter. Fuck you, bitch. I bet your mom taught you to fight. And taught you to just hang around rich people so that way you get money. Fucking gold digger. Are you hot a hearing? Fuck, man! Fuck you! You're a disappointment to your fucking mother, bitch! God, this is so fucking sick, though. Just seeing Batman flip around and shit. Oh! Oh, dude! Oh, that's so sick. You're still alive, bro? Fuck off! Telling you, Jack. <laughs> a little more pressure, and I'll crush your larynx. Oh you shit! All right, all right. Uh, he's in his office. Only way in is through the theater, on the other side of the casino. But you'll never get past Tracy. Tracy is not a problem. God damn, man! Look at all these fuckers. The last interrogation. <laughs> Yeah, he's still learning, guys. Still learning the kinks. Don't throw the guy off the fucking... <laughs> don't throw him off the fucking, uh... Off the roof. <laughs> oh, shit. This idiot doesn't know anything. My best bet for finding Black Mask lies with Penguin. Penguin will know where I can find Black Mask. But why is it... won't have any reliable information. I think that was the first game to do something like that, where it's like, the boss battle, <laughs> the dude is like a fake boss, it's so funny. <laughs> like, I played one recently, like, uh, this might be a spoiler, but in Jedi Survivor, there's one, and it's like, Tom the Janitor or something, and he comes out, and he has like a full health bar and everything, and it makes it seem like he's gonna be a really, really hard fight, and you just whoop his ass in one lightsaber hit. <laughs> it's so good. I love shit like that, it's so funny. Especially since the ex like the electrocutioner came up to him, like all hard. It's like, oh, I'm gonna kill you, and then I'm going to revive you and kill you again. Like, okay, dude, chill out. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Fuck, doing that voice fucked up my my throat. <laughs> okay, well, I can't get through there. Gotta go down here. Um, parkour? Hardcore parkour? Fuck him up. I love the, her accent, dude. It's so funny. What do you think he's gonna do to you, lot? Think about it, lads. You lot. That's one of my favorite British slang. You lot. Like, what the fuck is that shit, man? At least y'all make sense. What does you lot even mean? What the fuck does a lot have to do with people? 
I mean, I guess it's like you group of people, but like, why don't you just say y'all or something? Or some. I'm southern all of a sudden. All of a sudden, I've been on the, the east side, the south side, and the west side. I'm on the best side with the rest ride. <laughs> Shimmy. Nice. Are there people? Oh, there's people right here. Ledge takedown, baby. No way you didn't see that. Nice. Oh, dude, I like that. It stays in that mode. I think in Asylum, when you uh, go in detective mode and then you knock somebody out, it takes you out. But it doesn't do that in here. That's cool. Batman. I would do it to the rest of them. Why aren't they doing anything? I wonder if I'll get an achievement for this. Slow it down. Another one bites the dust. Oh, he saw me. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. I already got your other two. Why couldn't you go down with him? Dickhead. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure. I'm so scared of that guy. And now he's on the lamb. I should have tied him up and called the cops to get him. <laughs> Alfred, I had a run in with one of the assassins, Lester Bachinsky. The electrocutioner. Are you all right? Yes, but he managed to escape. His gloves put out a strong electromagnetic pulse. If you can isolate the signal, I'll be able to track him down. I'll get to work on that. Where are you off to now? I'm on my way to the final offer's casino. I'm going to make Penguin's assistant show me to her boss. Okay. We gotta pull this shit down. Bro, the fucking Christmas music is so weird after... Well, not weird. It's just funny how, like, we just went through Christmas and now it's a new year and there's still Christmas shit going on in this series. <laughs> I, I think it's also kind of crazy like it's been about f like a year maybe like four years not a year it's been three or four years since that fucking Arkham Asylum series and my YouTube journey it didn't stop there I didn't expect my YouTube journey to go anywhere honestly but it's been fun so far I love editing videos thumbnails again are my favorite thing and it's just so fun to play these old games and just record it for like myself or like anybody else who wants to watch this fucker's unconscious. <laughs> the casino. Penguin's assistant must be nearby. I'll make her tell me where I can find Cobblepot's office. Let's see. I'm just glad the game works and I can finally play this shit for you guys after all these years of... After that year of saying that I was going to, but we're back. And I went on hiatus for a while and played Spider-Man for a bit and... But then, Last of Us, and it reignited my love for YouTube videos, video making. Oh my fucking god! Can you guys chill out? I'm trying to, I'm trying to have a heart to heart with my fucking viewers, okay? Hey! Fucking piece of shit! Come on, okay then. Okay, you wanna fuck with me while I'm fucking talking? Fuck you, bitch. God. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was saying because I'm so angry. Mr. Cobblepot ain't taking new visitors, 
new vet says. Oh, he's got a glass. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I'm being passed around. I'm being passed around like a fucking porn star. Oh wait, the motherfucker's got a gun. Oh my god. Get this guy out of the way. Thank you. Jesus. Bro, I am so sloppy, man. Fuck. Fuck me. Says you. I've already been through like 40 of your boys. Did he say you're mean? <laughs> the fuck did he say? Bro, fuck off! Put down that gun, bitch! Well, there goes that guy. Bye bye! Sounds like Cobblepot's office is connected to the theater, and the entrance is controlled from that security room. Wait, am I supposed to be doing something here, or what are we waiting for? This just—it just opens up the thing, right? Yeah. That's what I did last time earlier in the video, when we first saw the first Enigma, like little thing. I just looked at the thing. I wasn't doing anything. Okay, well I'm locked in down here. Is there? Uh... One of these? I can do somewhere. What am I missing? Um. Hello? Oh, there's a shit down here. Open it up. Nice. Making enough, she can tell me what to do. Yeah, you're right. You can't let him get the upper hand. That's what my dad always said. Of course, mom would slap him right after. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's true. Toxic masculinity, man. Let's kill this son of a bitch. Say that and come and attack me, bro. No, she won't. I literally just destroyed everybody. Come on! Enough's enough! 
Open her up and let me out. No. Character profile. Ooh, she looked good. God damn. Her real name is unknown. Occupation Penguin's assistant based in Gotham City. Eye color brown. Hair color black. She is five foot eight. That's tall for a woman, fuck. And she usually wears heels. Using Penguin for income, criminal record exists. Only in associate only in association with Penguin. Potential for rehabilitation. Candy was raised on the streets, but managed to pull herself up with Earn and earn a business degree. Unfortunately, lean times and constricting job contracting con, contracting job markets <laughs> caused her to fall in with the penguin crowd. The penguins crowd. The recession has driven many well-educated people to take desperate action to support themselves, but that's no excuse for criminal behavior. Her crimes are minor, however, making her an excellent candidate for rehabilitation. I like that. That's cool. He's like not looking at her as like, oh, she's just paying with a sister. And he's really trying to look into her, see what kind of person she is. That's cool. Come on, let's uh, profile. Where are those at? Here. Damn, there's a shit ton. I want to see if maybe I could. Nah. Bane. Apparently, this is a male. Master Escape Harvest. Yeah, that would make sense, but. But this Copperhead is clearly a female. This could indicate that the name Copperhead is actually a title or a label for an underworld organization. Either way. Either way, Copperhead seems capable of escaping nearly all forms of confinement. Kill techniques range from strangulation and crushed, death, crushed bones to acute toxicity resulting in death. This motherfucker. Fuck you, bitch. God. This is her. Tracy Buxton. Penguin's assistant. Gotham City. She's also 5'8". God damn, the women in this universe are tall. How tall is Vicky? 5'7"? God damn. 5'10? Bruh. Okay. This is average woman height. 5'7. All this shit's unknown. Deceased. This ain't funny. I don't care what your boss is gonna be happy about. Make a deal. <laughs> I knew you didn't have what it takes to fight me fair. What are you talking about, lady? You attacked me with like 50 thugs. <laughs> you know what though? I think that's gonna be it. Been recording for a little over an hour now. Uh, next time out, we're gonna see what Kawapa has to say. I think we're going to him to see more information on Black Mask from what I remember from the first episode. That makes sense, but anyway, it's been great, and I will see you guys. Oh shit, I broke it. Hold on, can we? Nice, that's cool. Alright, well, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.